Today I'm going to show you how to make a crisscross book, which is made out of two pieces of paper, and it can be folded up in any different order of ways. You're going to need two pieces of paper. Mrs. Hayes cut these so they are exactly three by nine. That means each square will be about three inches, and there are cardboard squares to help you fold this the right way. So you can line up your cardboard square, hold it with one hand, bend it with the other, and I'm gonna move it over so that it lines up with my fold. I'm gonna draw that line so you can see it. You do not have to draw the line. And then I'm going to fold again. That gives me three squares that are all about the same size. It's okay if they're not perfect. My second piece of paper, I'm gonna do the same thing. Maybe it would help you to draw your lines first using the square. If you find that easier, you can try that method. And then I'm going to fold on those lines. Now I have two pieces of paper and they have three squares. So now I'm going to take a glue stick and I'm going to put glue just on one of the middle squares. Then I'm going to take my other strip of paper and I'm going to line it up, smooth it out, press it down. If you have any pencil lines that you want to erase, you can do that. That's why I use pencil. And then you can test and fold your strips to make a book. You can draw on this book, you can paint on the pages, you can glue stuff to it, you could tell a story. I did a little about Mrs. Hayes' book, put my name, I like cats, I like mint chocolate chip ice cream, so I have lots of room to do more pages.